Conway, counsel to the president. This, this helps Donald Trump tonight. This is a big, big beginning to the end of what has been a witch hunt from pretty much day one. So, Sean, this week we had the Comey book, and now tonight we finally have a Comey blockbuster that actually would interest and animate the public. What you just revealed is truly remarkable and breathtaking on many different levels. You revealed what the president, what Comey thought the president was asking him to do, and most importantly, not what, he, what Comey claims the president was asking him to do. And I think the most remarkable thing about what you just revealed is that this is a president who from the beginning has been compliant and transparent and has never gotten in the way of this investigation. Uh, what's remarkable to me this week is, you know, 30 days of Comey is going to be about 29 and a half days too much. And he's already not wearing well on this so-called book tour. For somebody to name his book Lies and Leadership What's the lies? Is he talking about Andrew McCabe, who's number two, who just had a criminal referral tonight, who's admitted now is an admitted liar? What leadership? What leadership when the people at the highest level who are investigating Hillary Clinton aren't even bothering to tell the FISA court judge that her political enemies have funded that phony dossier to the tunes of millions and millions of dollars? And in the case of James Comey, why Thank didn't you, he Kelly tell we can't President elect this. Trump on January 6th in Trump Tower? Right, but why didn't he just write it on his hands? What am I going to tell the president? Like milk, butter, eggs. Oh, your political opponents funded the dossier. Didn't even bother to tell him that. Told George Stephanopoulos story this week. I, I, had, I can't answer that question. It wasn't part of my goals. It's phony all the way. And the fact that you released, I think we should go on a, a Comey memo tour. Let's do that. Let's go on a yeah. Comey memo tour instead of a Comey book tour, because that's where the truth I, lies. You know, but, but, but Kelly, the seriousness of what they have put this country through. Now, he leaked. He yes. said, I'm, I'm not sneaky. I don't leak. BS. He leaked. And he leaked for the purpose He's of getting He admitted he leaked. This, he admitted it under oath. For the special counsel. But you add everything together. Yes. Hillary obstructed justice. They protected her, as Mark was saying earlier tonight. Absolutely, because she committed crimes. That is a fact. It's irrefutable, and it's and incontrovertible. And they thought she'd win, Sean. And they thought What's she'd that? win. We'd never know any of this. And they thought she'd win. They wanted oh, her to win, and they did. thought Hillary would win. Except us. That's yeah. really important here, because we would know none of this. We would know none of this unless if Hillary Clinton had actually won, which uh, Comey admitted uh, he was influenced by the phony baloney national media polls. I don't know why, why anybody was doing national polls. The statewide polls were relevant, as you know. That's what we did at the campaign. But more importantly, we would know none of this. We would, we would not know that the people at the highest levels investigating Hillary Clinton had the fix in for her and against Trump, uh, against uh, candidate Trump. But let these memos out there. People have been calling for transparency and accountability and continuing investigations for over a year. Look, people have called into question Jim Comey's credibility and everything this week. That's fine. But I'm grasping with his essential relevance at this point in this book. The relevance to Jim Comey is probably in these memos, not in a book. This is somebody who hardly knew the president. He's knitting you know, together a this. limited, limited amount of time. This yes. now needs to end for the sake of the country. Kellyanne, good to see you. Great points as always. When we come back, Ed Henry has new breaking details of the Comey memo.